Virgo, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for your likes, subscribes, and shares. If there's anything else you'd like to know about me, it's in the description. This reading will be for Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Keep in mind, you do not have to be a Virgo to resonate with this reading. Please take what resonates and leave the rest. Cross watchers are welcome. Virgo, gang, gang. I hope you are doing well. I hope you are taking care of yourselves because I am. Okay. I'm scared of thunderstorms, y'all, but yes, it is getting ready to storm here in Oklahoma. I know. I'm so sensitive. Okay. We have the Page of Cups reverse. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. So... The energy as of now, Virgo, you may feel like somebody is emotionally immature. Why the Page of Cups reverse? The Nine of Wands reverse. You could be defensive, feeling lack of motivation here when it comes to this connection because somebody is emotionally immature. Um, somebody here may have creative blocks as well. Energy as of now, somebody here could be insecure. How does Virgo feel towards this person? How does Virgo feel towards this person? The full card reverse. So you may feel like this person is hesitating. They're holding back their energy. Um, you may also feel like you're taking a risk when it comes to this connection. You have like this fearless energy about you right now. You have like, I'm hearing like a motherfucker can fuck around and find out if they want to. Oh, all right, 222 on the recorder. Okay, the full reverse, clarifying that we have the seven of swords reverse. How you feel towards this person. You could be rethinking your approach. Um, you may feel like this person is keeping secrets. You may feel like somebody needs to come clean about a situation. It's about to come down. I know, I'm such a wuss. Is it going to be bad? Hold up, y'all. Let me look at the weather. Severe thunderstorm watch. Until 3 p.m., 2 p.m.? Oh, it's like it might be a bad one, y'all. Okay, how does this person feel towards Virgo right now? How does this person feel towards Virgo right now? The star card reverse, Aquarius energy. We have insecurity out here twice. Lack of faith, despair, disconnection. So this person, they don't really feel all that connected to you. Um, they may have they may feel like you don't have faith in them or they may not have faith in you. The Eight of Wands reverse on how this person feels towards you. Frustration, holding off, waiting, panic, slow down. So somebody could be hold, like postponing something. Um, there may be some delays in this connection. There is something here that needs to come to light. Like somebody needs to tell the truth about something. What are the obstacles and blocks to this connection? What are the obstacles and blocks to this? Ten of Cups reversed, okay? 444 on a recorder. Shattered dreams, broken family, domestic disharmony, disconnection, struggling relationships. So this, this is a connection that's struggling here. Wow, 
Why the Ten of Cups reverse? The Chariot reverse. Lack of direction, lack of a uh, lack of control, aggression, arrogance, and carelessness. You could be going with somebody that's quite arrogant, emotionally immature. Um, somebody's dreams. You, you may feel like your dreams have been shattered due to a connection, or they may feel that way. What is the advice? To this the nine of cups wish come true contentment stability luxury and gratitude just be grateful be grateful that you woke up this morning be grateful for the small things the little things 555 on a quarter temperance you could be dealing with a sagittarius but temperance clarifying the nine of cups Balance, harmony, moderation. So everything in, in moderation. Um, finding meaning in life. Being grateful that for some of you, you already found your life purpose. So be grateful for that. In the outcome, we have personal goals. The two of wands reverse. Inner alignment. Fear the unknown. Playing it safe. So somebody could be playing it safe in this connection not stepping outside of their comfort zone, whether it's you or them. The two of cups reverse, overcommitted, reprioritized, lack of balance, overwhelmed. Two of wands and two of pentacles reverse, okay? And the outcome. So somebody's playing it safe because they fear change. Um, it's time to reprioritize your life and there may be a lack of balance in this connection somebody may feel like you're a drama queen or a drama king Family, blood ties, inner circle, energy as of now. So there could be some issues around family. Maybe you and this particular person have different cultural backgrounds or different religious beliefs. Drastic, extreme, harsh, cut off. How you feel towards this person? Hmm. So you may feel like somebody needs to come clean or you may have cut somebody off because they weren't fully honest. There's no balance in this anyway. How does this person feel towards Virgo? Pop up. Spontaneous, unexpected, surprise visit. Somebody may surprise you, pop up on you. They want to, okay? Insatiable, unquenchable, and wanting more. And the obstacles and blocks. Somebody could lack discipline here. Somebody could be a nympho. Somebody may have a sex addiction. Desire, less sexual chemistry. Can't make this shit up. Who gives a fuck? All right, one more card in the outcome. Interview, talk, conversation, get on the same page. So there may be a compromise that's made here so you both can be on the same page. On the bottom, we have journal, writing, diary, and keeping notes. So maybe some of you need to start a gratitude journal or diary or just write some things down. Um... Yeah, let me get one of these. Reaching out. Expect a call or text from your person of interest. So you and this person may not be speaking, but this person may want to come clean and confess something to you. Well, Virgo, this is all I have for you. Thank you so much for tuning in. You know I love you guys, and I'll talk to you soon.